Yo, what is up guys and welcome back to another episode of Slice of Shonen. I am your host, The Cloudy Crow, and today we will be reacting to Licorice Recoil Episode 3. And I must say, man, I'm really starting to warm up to this series. At first, I liked it. The second episode was a little confusing at first, but towards the end, like, oh my gosh, that ending was so good, completely caught me off guard. I wasn't ready for it, and now I am so, so excited to get further into this series. So without any further ado, let's dive into this third episode. So if you guys are excited for the episode, make sure to leave a like. And while you're down there, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Lastly, do not forget that over on my Patreon, there are a bunch of bonuses. If you join the $2 tier, then you get access to all of my uncut reactions, including this series. And if you join the $5 tier, then you get to see next week's episode one week ahead of everybody else on YouTube. But with that all out of the way, let's dive into this, man. Is this a different mission, or is this the mission from episode one? It's like a flashback. Yep, flashback. And here it is. Firing the minigun. And the reasoning for her demotion. She's still thinking about it. And I wonder if Chisato's words last episode reminded her. Because... Again, just in case anyone's watching this that didn't watch the last episode, Takina was kind of grilling Chisato because she's saying the only reason why Walnut, or the lady in the costume, got shot in the first place was because they split up and that Chisato should have stuck with them. But Chisato responded with, well, everyone made it out in the end, so it's fine, right? And Takina originally thought the same. When she used her minigun and fired it and took down all the bad guys, even though her partner was in the line of fire, she was thinking, it should be fine, right? Nobody got hurt. But yet, her other teammates went up to her, punched her in the face, and it all led to her getting demoted. Which showed her that you can't just do whatever you want as long as everyone makes it out at the end. Because there's a chance that they might not all make it out. And it's the same here. There was a chance they might not all have made it out. So, maybe this is why Takino was reliving that moment here. Here we got Walnut, aka Kurumi. More haste, less speed. Okay. Are they trying to decipher who that person is? Still? Let's see. Put that hacker magic into action. Look at that. In an instant. She was able to make it happen. She's like, you guys don't need me anymore. I can't wait. Like, next time someone asks her for a favor, she's gonna be like, Why don't you go ask Walnut? <laughs> Who is this guy? <laughs> he looked like somebody straight out of Yu-Gi-Oh! Like freaking Seto Kaiba. This is cool. They're all sitting around playing a board game. Are these customers? Dang. Too many old guys here. <laughs> you guys scared her away. Don't slam it in her face, please. Uh, okay, I was about to say. Because <laughs> that's going to hurt. Nope, of course not. Classic cheese Sato. You know what? I relate to Chisato so much. Both of us are procrastinators, man. We la we wait until the last possible moment. <laughs> he's, he's trying to look away. <laughs> Dang, she is in game mode right now. So they're going to meet up with the higher-ups, right? And my guess is her goal is she's going to try to come up with some sort of statement to get her old job back. Here we go. I love the music in this anime. It's always so fun. Sorry, 
physical fitness test. Wait, hold on. This sounds fire. At first, I just thought it was like, you know, when you go to the doctor and get your physical. But it seems like she's going to be doing, like, training drills and stuff. Aw, oh, classic. Gossiping teens. Dang. Yeah, she wants no parts of this. That girl must have been like an old, you know, teammate of hers or something. No, she knows her. I mean, <laughs> that is true. Chisato definitely was lazy. Here we go, Takina. Look at that. All oh, bullseyes. I don't think you can get much more precise than that without firing through the same hole. Dude, this is so cool. I love how they're like moving back and forth slowly. Oh, they have this too? Reflexes? Oh my god! Holy crap, you saw her? She was like a spider monkey, slapping all of those buttons at once. Oh no. Ooh. だけど仲間を救った。その決定戦長の銃の行方は依然不明だ。取引時間間違えてたシレーブのせいです。クスノキさんにだって責任ある。うー、talk Radio interference, huh? Mm, that is kind of fishy now that you mention it. True. He's hiding something for sure. And we know what. But let's see if Chisato can figure it out. Because they were hacked, right? And I'm guessing these guys don't know about it. Her successor is already here. She seems cool. I like her haircut. It's actually kind of fire. Jesus. Oh, uh, never mind. I thought she was cool. Seems like she's trying to pick on Takina. <laughs> Calm down, Jamal. Don't pull out the nine. <laughs> Oh, so she's who the other girl was talking about when it comes to being her successor. Dang! Grabbed her by the collar? Wait, why are they all here? You <laughs> see that delinquent coming out in her voice? Man, this is brutal. Oh my gosh, man. This girl is the worst. Oh no. She is so dumb to take on Chisato. <laughs> this guy sucks, man. That's a shame. We well, we did meet one cool person. She just didn't really get the opportunity to say anything because Takina ran away, but hopefully we see her again. Mm. 
Yeah. She's definitely feeling like a failure right now. Oh. Doesn't want her anymore. That is, that's heartbreaking to hear, honestly. I feel so bad, because she tries so hard, too. Technical trouble? Sure. Yep, she knows. Ah, so them getting hacked is a huge deal. Oh! Wow! Is she about to expose them? Yeah, we gotta come up with a plan first. Dang, she said so wise. I probably would have tried to come up with a plan. But then again, who would that really help? Dang, Chisato doesn't care what anyone says. She's just having a good time, man. Not gonna lie, I ship these two. Not gonna lie. I really want to see that mock battle, though. I want to see one of them, uh, you know, put their money where their mouth is. One of the girls that were talking trash. Or get humbled, I guess. There you go! Me and Chisato, man. We're like this. Oh, I'm so dumb. This is the girl that was in the crossfire. Yeah, she probably didn't want that to happen to Takina. Wow, she blames herself. Previous partners. Now she's gonna go. <laughs> Looks like she's a token talks my smack too. Aw oh, man, you hear that delinquent? <laughs> that rolling arm, man? She's got a little too. They're really going at it right now. I love this. <laughs> or is she about to 2v1 these clowns? Here we go. Look at this. It's just too easy. Ooh, that's kind of clean. The fire behind the back. <laughs> these guys got some moves. Dang, kicked a metal door down? Look at her dodging these bullets. Look at that. Done for. Oh my god! And she's disarmed! You better have another in your holster or something. Is she waiting for Takina to finally join? Oh no. Their teamwork is crumbling. Nope, nope. If you want to hit her, you better bring out the hands. Because these guns are not working. Oh, the slide! And here's Takina. Oh! She got her get back! Oh my god! Beautiful. Both of them are down, dude. She got her lick back. That is hilarious. Especially because we all know she didn't have to. She easily could have shot her while her back was turned. But she ran in, <laughs> got that quick lick in, and then gunned her down. That was so sick. Now they know how incredible she is. Even from point blank. That is true. 
Yeah, that's what I'm saying. She was getting her get back. Mmm, look at that. <laughs> that's gonna hurt in the morning. Oh yeah, and I'm guessing you punching her was a part of your orders? Shut up. See, I thought so too. <laughs> I thought so too. She's here. Oh, no, nah, that's so messed up. <laughs> that's so messed up. I wish they could have talked, though. I think that'd be a really enlightening conversation. For Takino to hear how the girl whose life was in danger feels about it. And the fact that she doesn't think Takino deserved to be kicked out. Is she gonna be smiling? There we go. See? Now they're locked in, dude. There we go. Beautiful anime. The two of us will be there. This show... Like, it's so cool because at first... I thought the main appeal of this show was gonna be the characters, like the two main characters and their friendship together. I thought that was gonna be the main number one appeal, because that's all anyone ever talked about when I heard about the show beforehand. But the writing is phenomenal, I'm not gonna lie. Every single episode so far has been fantastic. I have no critiques. I think they are so well executed. So. Maybe this is the reason why everybody loves it. Hello? Oh, okay. Are they like at a shooting range or something? Oh, wow, and Chisato can't even hit it. That's surprising. Ah! Okay, okay. So that explains why she walked up to the person while shooting instead of like getting behind cover or somewhere safe. She doesn't have the craziest aim, but she has an incredible sense for, like, you know, the trajectory that bullets are flying at her with. And look at Takina. Interesting. Yep, no longer the case. Nothing seek, nothing find. Oh, that was Chisa too? I was wondering who the heck was making that sound. Oh, okay. So it's like a VR game? This game looks crazy. Let's see how Tagina can do. Ooh! She's- wait, she's already so good! Looks like her, uh, training has paid off. And look, Chisa too already knew. What to look out for? Oh, of course, of course. <laughs> winner, winner, chicken dinner, dude. What is this, VR PUBG? Oh, it was online! Dang, they can't even win in the video game. These guys stink. Oh my god. <laughs> so, I wonder, do they not know if they're playing each other? But they... You know, they hate that name, because they hate the other person, but they're not 100% sure if it's actually the other person or not. What? Oh, she's wearing, like, what are they called? Shorts? Boy shorts or something? So that's why she was surprised. I thought she was getting a, a sneaky angle over there when she did that backflip. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what? I think I know where this is going. Is Chisato? Yep, yep. She's gonna teach her how to be more girly. Plain clothes. I gotta dress casual. <laughs> Asking for his advice again. Not bad. It's definitely like casual. 
<laughs> I mean, you know it's Takino. Of course she's gonna bring a gun with her. She's the kind of person where, like, you never know what's gonna happen, so you gotta always be prepared. I really like Chisato's outfit, though. That headband kind of goes crazy. Alright, girls' night out? Or, I guess, girls' day out? <laughs> Taking a bath while looking at online prices for guns? <laughs> Dude, I I love her already. I'm not gonna lie, she might be my favorite character. And we just met her last episode. Or two episodes ago. I just love how, like, unbothered she is about everything. Okay, so now we're trying on some different fits. Not bad, not bad. I feel like none of those really click like crazy, though. This one still is it's okay it doesn't suit her as well as like you know chisato's outfit suits her if that makes any sense see now she's gonna go for the one that has like the best performance you know <laughs> gives her the most the most range of movement on the battlefield exactly see come on now come on <laughs> what is Jesus trying to say here? Is Jesus going to do it? There she is. <laughs> she looks ashamed though. <laughs> or embarrassed. See, we already know where this is going. I can already see the future of this series <laughs> and the route we're going down. Bonbons? Greek yogurt? That's pretty close to ice cream, isn't it? Let's see what it looks like, though, because you know anime food always slaps. Sugary fried cotton toe. I wish I knew what that was. It sounds interesting. Sugary and fried. Ooh! Like I said, anime food never disappoints. Unless you're watching Food Wars. Oh, are they French? Does she speak French? Interesting. Okay, she's flexing her language skills. Oh, is she helping them understand the menu? Since they're foreigners? That's cool. And look at how happy Takina is. Just spending a nice, relaxing day with Chisato. Just a couple of girls going out shopping. I'm sure she hasn't really had too many moments like this in the past. If at all. What is this? Is she in a VR game too now? Or is she looking at the... What is this? This isn't the place where the drug deal went down, is it? It is the drug deal. Now they're at the aquarium? This is basically just like a date at this point. I mean, there has to be, right? See, I would be on the same length as uh, Takina here. Just fascinated at all the different fish and how they came to be the way that they are. But they don't know that, yeah. To them, you're just a couple of normal girls. The rubber ones? I wonder, yeah, I was about to say, I wonder if it was ever since the tower incident. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Don't spin this into something it's not. Mm, that's fair. I like that reasoning. If you don't have to, 
then, you know, why resort to it immediately? Hmm. Yeah, but I think... So Takina doesn't know that she got kicked out. Or did she actually voluntarily leave? Because at least the impression that I got was that she got demoted to this position after the tower incident. An owl? Oh my gosh. Yeah, <laughs> don't, don't kid yourself. <laughs> Not that she's bad looking or anything, but she doesn't have the, like, the, I guess, aura that, like, a model would have. Mmm, so that is hinting at a potential backstory in the future. I don't think we're gonna get it now, but sometime down the line for sure. And look! Even Tagina starting to open up here. Look at how much fun she's having, dude. See, this is how you know you've made a real friend. If they're, like... If you feel comfortable enough around them to do stuff like this. Dang. This... Dude, this Takina and Takina from episode 1 are, like, night and day. She's changed so much. For the better, in my opinion. Ooh, these two. See where this conversation goes. Wait, what? So what, does she not remember his face? Maybe it's just the necklace? She's looking for someone that has an identical necklace, maybe? Oh, new character. You can tell from the hair, he's gonna be important. Okay, the goons. Moving into position. Where'd the third guy come from? In the fourth. In the fifth. In the sixth. <laughs> All of these guys were hidden in plain sight. A lie, huh? Oh, what's he planning to do here? Oh no, don't tell me. The, the flashbacks, don't tell me. This is the Modern Warfare 2 campaign all over again. Oh, yep, he is for sure. Oh my god, who's on this train? That warrants bringing like four machine guns. I hope no one's on there and they just wasted their ammunition. Because I don't see blood or anything. Oh! They were prepared! Ooh, they're messing him up too. He looks like he's gonna slip away though. Oh, plan B. Now that's not good. Oh my god. That's scary, dude. That's actually scary. I hope those girls are okay. I mean, I'm sure they didn't... I'm sure they're not gonna come out of this unscathed. But I hope that, you know, the worst that didn't happen to them. It looked like the whole... <clears throat> the whole station came crumbling down. Dude, this is so cool. The, like, employees at the cafe just sitting down playing board games with the customers. That looks fun. Oh, and here are the detectives. You know, this guy's the veteran, and the other guy is, like, the, the fresh meat. The new kid on the block. Oh, my gosh. Don't get any ideas! <laughs> Jeez, that's a chill! Oh, she's trying them on, okay. I thought it was gonna be some, like, Mushoku Tensei stuff, <laughs> like she was gonna hold on to it. 
Caught her red handed. Oh! <laughs> what a crazy misunderstanding. Oh no! You can't just. Oh! She's not gonna believe her. Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> Exposing her in front of everybody? <laughs> This is amazing. But look, she's even angling the fan. I love this music. Oh, wow. We've never heard Tuck in his laugh before now, have we? That was adorable. What the heck? We gotta replay that. <laughs> All right, so we got an end credit scene here. And he did end up slipping away. Oh, the hacker. This isn't good. Dang. Hung up on him. Oh. So he did that to try to cause a scene. But everybody ended up, um... I don't know if it was the actual, like, licorice company that covered it up or the police that covered it up, but they painted it as an accident. And I'm guessing he wanted to, you know, stir up some trouble and, I guess, get himself out there. Put his face on the newspapers and stuff. Maybe to kind of instill fear in people that there's this madman going around doing all this crazy stuff. I want you guys in the comment section to let me know what your favorite dessert is because here we got to see Takina and Chisato sit down, have some desserts, have a good time. So I want to know what you guys' favorite dessert is. For me, I'm not super big into sweets. I don't eat sweets very often, but uh, if I had to choose a favorite, man, I don't know. It's hard. I think I might have to go with, like, mint chocolate chip ice cream. That'd probably be my favorite. But let me know what your favorite is in the comment section down below. And with that, I'm going to head out. Thank you all so much for watching this far into the video. And I will catch you all in the next one. Have a good one.